Hello, Tiger fans, and welcome to Earning Their Stripes. I'm Thomas Watson, a senior government and history major from Midlothian, Virginia, and today I'm joined by Amos Nickens, a freshman uh, defensive end here on the football team hailing from Sterling, Virginia, uh, majoring in business and economics. Mm -hmm. Amos, ready to earn your stripes? Yes, sir. All right, let's do it. Start it off for you. Who's your favorite professional athlete? Professional athlete? Uh, I might have to take it back to Ray Lewis. He was like one of the best out there, always inspiring people, inspiring me, made me be the man that I am today. And an absolute, you know, menace on the football field too. Yep. All right, so if you had to give me your favorite food, you know, what are you chowing down on? I'm going to be chowing down on chicken parmesan and some mac and cheese. Oh, that's, that, yep. sounds, that sounds good right about now. Mm -hmm. What about your favorite TV show? Favorite TV show? I'm going to have to go with Spongebob. I'm a little funny guy. Don't really take it that much serious. That's me. Yeah. That's, hey, that's a classic, too. Yeah. What about uh, some of the, your motivations to work hard? Motivations is I uh, want to be better for my family and just keep on striving. So it be like my father, because he's always been grinding hard. My mom um, and my grandma. She's 78 years old and still pushing hard to be a working hard person. Sounds like you have a good work ethic in the family then. Mm hmm So, if you had to give me your proudest accomplishment, what would that be? Accomplishment? Being senior captain and making it here to college, playing football, and doing the things I love. Absolutely. Now, not a lot of people get to go follow their dreams of college sports. Mm hmm So, we make you choose on this next one. Okay. Call, text, or FaceTime? FaceTime. Definitely FaceTime guy. Yeah, FaceTime. I mean, it's just... Seeing the face is nothing like text message or nothing like that. I'd rather just FaceTime if I got the free time. Definitely more personal. Yeah. So, if you could give me a couple good words to describe yourself, what do you got? Funny, brave, and uh, I really haven't really been thinking too much about that. But if I had to, the third one would be caring. I always care about everybody before myself. It's just the way I am. Very selfless guy then. Yeah. So you mentioned you were funny, which brings up another question. Mm -hmm. On a scale of 1 to 10, how funny would you rate yourself? Uh, I would rate myself probably around like 7 or 8. Okay, so you're bringing the jokes. Yeah. On the same scale, what are your friends saying? I don't know. I'm hoping to be higher, to be honest. I mean, they would always be laughing at my jokes and always saying that I'm a funny guy, but I don't, I don't know. <laughs> so they, should be, they better give you that good yeah, rating then. You have to see. <laughs> so, uh, you, I know you're a business econ guy, but what mm -hmm. is your favorite subject when it comes to academics? I'm allowed to say history. Um, when you're not out there on the football field, what can we find you doing? What are some of your hobbies or interests? Uh, you probably find me playing video games, playing 2K, or um, out there just hanging with friends, out there working on trucks or fishing. Let's be honest. Keeping okay. yourself busy? Yeah. Definitely. So, if you could be anybody or do anything for a day, who would you be and what would you do? If I can be anybody, I'd probably be Ray Lewis and helping out people and probably giving back to the community as well. That's basically me. Uh, a lot of cool places here at Hampton City, but do you have a favorite spot on campus? Uh, I'm going to have to go with my boy Trevor Wade with the library and also the TI. Yeah. So, if you had to give me one of your favorite books to, as a recommendation, what would that be? My book would be Diary of a, Diary of a Wimpy Kid. That was one <laughs> of my favorite books. <laughs> that was the only book that stuck with me from high school and elementary and all the way up. Uh, I'm going to make you choose again on the next one. Okay. Beach or mountains? The beach guy. Definitely beach. Like the sun, like jet skiing in the water. Toes in the sand. Yep. Hard to beat. Mm hmm. All right, I got one more for you today. All right. Who knows you best? My pops. I was always raised with him. He knew me inside out. Always guided me in the right direction and everything that I needed to be on this path. So it's my pops. Definitely. And it seems he's gonna done a good job so far. Yes, sir. Well, that's the last one we have for you today. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, this has been Amos Nickens, and he has earned his stripes.